Now we're going to try to show you a little bit about the cockpit. I'll back off a little bit so that you can see this and back down for right now. This has a sliding canopy with a control or with a slide in the back and one on each side. I'm going to open this up and if you bear with me just one second, I'm going to get a light so that we can try to see in the cockpit. There we go. Now you can see a little bit of the equipment in there. There's the bomb sight. Over on the side there are controls. I think you can probably see the instruments and you can see the pilot's got his hand out trying to get a hold. I'll shut this off. We'll back off again. <laughs> of course this could be on a mechanism which would open and close it automatically. I elected not to do that because it would add weight. Anyway we'll slide it closed. We do put a screw on each side to hold it in place. Is where the gas filler was on the uh, fuel tank which was in the fuel fuselage. And I don't know whether you can read that. It says uh, suitable for aromatic fuels in red letters. And right next to it is the ground where you put the ground wire. I'll back off a little bit more. The Q and the P uh, that's what it was on the real airplane. It uh, really stands out with the red around the outside. The star and bar was in this position. There are four seven three three oh four. That was on the real airplane. And you can see the inspection panel covered with flight metal aluminum. That's why the panels stand out like they do. I'm going to back up and try to show you the entire airplane in one view. And I hope it comes in as good as I can see it. This is the first time that I've used uh, this camera. And it appears that it's coming in fairly well. I hope it comes in as well as I think it does. So with that underneath where the wing fastens into place, you can see the air scoop, which is a functional air scoop. And you'll see that in a future video, which I hope to take, which air comes in the front of that air scoop. That was for the radiator and the oil cooler on the real airplane. And it comes out the back. You can see the opening in the back. That's where the tune pipe exhaust comes out.